Tonight, D.C. police are investigating a triple shooting near Howard University. The violence erupted early this morning. Luckily, all three victims are expected to survive. This all unfolding during the school's homecoming weekend. Fox 5's David Kaplan is live for us tonight where the shooting happened. David, what details have you been able to gather so far? Yeah, Sierra, good evening to you. We are told this shooting happened just before 2 o'clock. We're at the intersection of 8th Street and Berry Place here near the Howard University campus uh, in the Shaw area. Just to kind of give you some insights on where we are, that is Georgia Avenue. As you know, Howard University is on both sides of Georgia Avenue. So we are west here on 8th Street. I got a chance to talk to an eyewitness who was here around 2 a.m. We know that three people were shot, two women and one man. He says he's friends with the two women. One was shot in the knee, the other in the stomach. Just to give you some insights, you can still see some of the crime scene tape here as we know this investigation is active and ongoing. Can also tell you we're not showing it on TV, but there is a pool of blood that does remain on the sidewalk here at the Howard University uh, campus, near the campus. Now, have to be clear here, there's no direct evidence that this is related to Howard homecoming weekend, but we're told many people were out and about near campus as part of the celebration. Campus Public Safety sent an email to students with basic information alerting them of the shooting but did not provide much in the way of details beyond what police put out. Anaya Shaw is a student who lives in a nearby dorm and had her windows open overnight when she heard the shots, but she didn't think much of it at the time. Then she got that campus-wide email. Yeah, I was scared. I was like, oh, wow, that's crazy. Like, I heard a shooting happen and... Like, I didn't know if it was, like, real or not. Fox 5 did reach out to Howard University to see if they had any updates or insights on this. We did not hear back. All we have from them is the email that they shared with students. D.C. police are not releasing the name or a suspect description at this time. It's still very much under active investigation, this shooting. Again, the three people who were shot expected to be okay. If there are any updates on this case, Sierra. We'll be sure to pass that along to you. All right. We know you always stay ahead. Thanks, David.